In Indiana, one man met the challenge of continuing farming after a hunting accident left him paralyzed from the waist down. I was in a hunting accident in 1980, fall of 1988. Fell out of a tree, lit on something on the ground, either binoculars or whatever. So then they got the ambulance out and they took me to the hospital. My back was severely crushed between T9 and T10. It wasn't severed, but it was crushed. And they said I'd never walk, which I guess it didn't soak in or what. I guess I just didn't listen to them because I thought I was going to walk again. I'm still not so sure of that, but that I ain't. But I've accepted it for the time being the way it is. Got home, breaking the ground came around, and then we just have went from there. Arlen uh, contacted us and asked us to come to his farm to help him analyze some of the farming problems, analyze some of the uh, situations he was running into where he couldn't access his equipment, he couldn't do things around the shop. Uh, it, in fact, when he called, he couldn't even get into his shop. Uh, he needed ideas and, and resources about farming with a spinal cord injury, and uh, that's where we come in.